In this video, we present a novel approach to robotic hysterectomy, the two-port technique. The two-port robotic hysterectomy is indicated for patients requiring a hysterectomy with good uterine mobility and lateral access. We present the case of a 41-year-old female with symptomatic adenomyosis. Her uterus measures 10 cm in length. A 12 mm port is placed in the umbilicus and an 8 mm robotic port is placed suprapubically. The optimal distance between the two ports is 15 cm to minimize the collision between the two robotic arms. The case begins with transection of the round ligament and opening of the retroperitoneal space. The tissues are placed under tension with a uterine manipulator. A 30 degree scope directed downwards is used to aid in visualization. The ureter is identified and the avascular, paravesical, and pararectal spaces developed. After identification of the ureter, a window is created in the posterior leaf of the broad ligament, medial to the ureters, and lateral to the ascending branches of the uterine artery. This allows isolation of the uterines and uterovarian pedicles. A generous bladder flap is created over the interior fornix delineator to prevent any bladder injury during cuff closure. After skeletonization of the uterine arteries, the monopolar scissors were then switched to fenestrated bipolar. The vascular pedicles were desiccated with bipolar. Another switch with monopolar scissors allow transection of the vascular pedicles. Circular colpotomy is made with monopolar and the uterus is detached and retrieved through the vagina. We propose two approaches for salpingectomy. The vaginal approach with a ring forceps to help the traction of the tube while the monopolar scissors are used to transect it. The abdominal approach with the help of a transcutaneous needle grasper 
that allows traction and facilitate the transaction with monopolar. The calf closure is performed robotically with the help of two curved aluses. They help grasping the interior and posterior cuff to create traction while the needle holder is used to close the cuff with barbed suture in a running fashion. After conclusion of the procedure, the fascia is closed and the umbilicus reconstructed. The two-port robotic hysterectomy is a novel, minimally invasive approach to hysterectomy. It is feasible in the appropriately selected patients with well-trained surgeons.